today we are going to learn the three different ways to find the area of the triangle so the first is the most popular that we uh, usually came across that is the area of triangle is equals to this is the formula 1 by 2 multiplied by base multiplied by height so b is for base base of the triangle and h is for height height of the triangle so if you are given with these two parameters you can easily find the area of the triangle i can also give you the example here that if you are given with a triangle like if i draw here like this and you are given with the base value as 5 cm and the height is 2 cm and you will be asked to find the area of the triangle you can easily find it in other case you can also find the area of the triangles that are like of this shape or of this shape you just need the height and the base so in such a case you can find the height like this if it is given and in it in this case the height will be like this and this will be the base and same here this will be the base now one thing more here is this uh, this uh, method is also applicable when you are given other two sides of the triangle in case of the right angle triangle right if you are given with the hypotenuse and the base and you are not given with the height you can easily find it by using you can easily find the height by using the Pythagoras theorem so this formula is good for most of the uh, in most uh, of the triangle cases where base and height is given now one more uh, way to find the area of the triangle is the hero's formula now what is this let's write it down as triangle is equals to under root s into s minus a s minus b and s minus c now what is s here what is a b and c here so keep this in mind that s is basically the half perimeter s is basically the half perimeter half peri perimeter is what perimeter is the sum of all sides when you divide the sum of all sides with the 2 you will get the s so if i write here where s is equals to a plus b plus c divided by 2 and this is also called half perimeter and a b c are the values of the three sides of the triangle and this formula is applicable when you know all the three sides of the triangle even if you know the two sides of the triangle you can easily find the third side by using the Pyth pythagoras theorem if the angle is right angle triangle keep this in mind pythagoras theorem is applicable only when the triangle is right angle triangle if the triangle is not right angle triangle and you don't know the third side then the hero's formula will not be applicable so you have to apply the uh, hero's formula when you know all the three sides to find the area of the triangle we are given with let's say a is equals to 3 b is equals to 5 and c is equals to 4 then the area of triangle will be like triangle is equals to under root s s is the sum of the all sides divided by 2 so 5 plus 3 8 8 plus 4 12 12 divided by 2 is 6 so 6 minus 3 is 3 6 minus 5 is 1 and 6 minus 4 is 2 so area of triangle is equals to like this and under root 36 and triangle is equals to 6 so 6 centimeter square will be the area of the triangle so this is how you can find the area of the triangle using hero's formula so one more method that you can use to find the area of the triangle is when you are given with the two sides and an angle this is also another method that you can use in order to find the area of the triangle so it will be like area of the triangle is equals to 1 by 2 multiplied by a b sine of c so where a b c like a b are the two sides of the uh, of the triangle and, and c is the angle that will be between the side a and b so you can also use this method in order to find the area of the triangle so where you can write a and b are the sides of the triangle and c is the angle between a and b so you can use this formula in case you are given with the angle you can you are given with the two sides so you can easily do that do this so if i take the example here i can write here as if a is equals to 3 b is equals to 2 and angle is equals to that is c or theta is equals to 30 degree so you can easily apply this formula as a is equals to 1 by 2 3 multiplied by 2 dot sine of 30 degree so sine 30 is equals to 1 by 2 so it will be equals to 3 by 2 equals to 1.5 centimeter square will be the area of the triangle in such a case so these are the three different ways 
or the most popular ways that you can use to find the area of the triangle. So that's all from today's lecture. Thank you.